Every moment for me nowadays, it feels like just I'm dreaming. So it's still like truth that we are actually out of group, but still I, I, I can't believe that we actually made it. But yeah, I just feel like I'm dreaming, yeah. It's, it's weird, you know, like, because you try to ignore it, of course, that all the hates and all the comments, but at one point you just like, it would be nice to just stop with this meme or whatever that we are the weakest, like that we are the weak links of V2. It would be like nice if that thing goes away. And uh, I mean, for me personally, it's just like, I don't care if they say if I'm bad or I'm good. The, what matters in the end is if my teammates trust in me and I trust in them, right? And if we can play good as a team, then I'm happy. They are, they are, they are spreading really hard. Huh? And we still have a game to play after this, so you can play. You can play without regrets. So last time I was at Worlds with Splice, we were very, very inexperienced. So this this Worlds in uh, 2018 feels a lot more calm, and it feels like we have a lot more control over the situation, and we can like be play more our own own style and play more like as we did in Europe, and not really fall into the the trap where they're they're so much better than us. We have to like copy them, and we have to like do whatever do whatever it takes to get on their level. We are kind of on our own level in the start and we can like compete with a lot of the teams whereas before it felt like we were kind of doomed from the beginning. I think that for me the two best experiences in groups, you know, considering I'm playing league, uh, was first game against Africa because you know back then we didn't know that we can actually win against them. Like we we knew but it was really exciting to win against you know the, the Korean team and then every team started with like even you know Cloud9 and, and Vitality started winning against like RNG and Genji so I think like the gap is like a little bit smaller so you know we won and we're really happy and then my second like most happy moment is when we had really tough tough draft early game and I played Nocturne against uh, the Vietnamese team uh, Buffalo and it was really hard for me because you know they had three pushing lanes and they would just like pair my invade with Olaf which is good into Nocturne so I couldn't really do much in the game but we did outscale and we did make some peaks and Luca like played really, really well that game. So it was really happy for me that we actually won because this game was so, so difficult. I mean, I always knew even when we had like our drops during our like super lows when we were playing really bad me and what did and nothing was really working out in scrims. I, I still know that we are good players and sometimes you just need to like believe in yourself that you can actually do it because you've been playing I've been playing this game for so many years and I know that I can be really good. So actually you know Mitty told me to not tilt after I lose one game and I didn't tilt after I lose one game and he told me if you don't tilt after losing one game you will make it out of groups. So now I expect to make it out of groups oh, because yeah. otherwise he would lie to me. <laughs> and I don't like when people lie to me. And then you tilt. <laughs> and then I fucking tilt <laughs> Before I would like think, oh, what we leave, what we win, what we lose. But I was just really enjoying the day, enjoying playing four games in one day. Even though after we won, I felt really, really exhausted. So it was just a nice, nice day of many games. So of course, like thank Mr. Buffalo for giving us a chance to tie break. That's for me as well. I think that the day overall was like. A lot of like happiness because we did make it to quarters, but also a little bit of disappointment because we will face against a really good team now in quarters, and uh, it feels like we have been first. Even though we are one-one against Africa, so I'm actually not sure if we are a better team. So maybe they do deserve the first place. Just it was not like, yes, I did it. It's just like finally it ends up, you know, because it was really exhausting day and. It's really tired, like I was so tired because it was so much different pressure compared to other games, right? It did, one game decides everything. So like my back was actually breaking, I felt like, and my wrist as well, like my brain was exploding as well. So I was just happy that we 
just did our final game and then we could take break. <laughs>